So today is a pretty big day. First of all, it is the day that I'm going to be unboxing a very cool product from Silverstone. This is the Silverstone Hard Drive Boost or HDD Boost. And it is also an exciting day because it is the last day of the Esther's Easter Extravaganza. I'm just going to pick up my camera here and have a look at that. Esther's Easter Extravaganza, chance to win a basket bonanza sweepstakes, where you have a chance to win a card with, uh, sorry, a card, a system with a GTX 480 graphics card. So that is, and this is the code word if you're here looking for that, a Fermi, F-E-R-M-I. So without further ado, why don't we get started on the HDD Boost unboxing. So it comes in a fairly simple brown box, you can see here. And uh, okay, yeah, it's a very simple box. Easy to install, compatible with most two and a half inch SATA SSDs. Minimum SSD data write times help extend the SSD life cycle. So as you may or may not know, SSDs do have a limited number of times that you can actually write to the whole disk and then rewrite, rewrite, rewrite over it. So while with most modern SSDs it's not a huge problem, they're still saying that yes, you know what, this will go ahead and it'll reduce the number of writes that you're doing so it'll increase the lifetime of the drive. Great. You can boost your original system hard drive read speeds without reinstalling your operating system. That's pretty cool too. So create your own super drive with maximum storage and maximum speed. So they're basically saying that you get all of the benefit of an SSD, which is fast response times with all of the benefit of a hard drive, which is inexpensive and high capacity. So here we are. Let me see. It's nickel. It is one millimeter SPCC with nickel plating. It needs five volt in from the PC power supply. The requirements are fairly simple. You need to have an SSD and a hard drive. So let's get this opened up and have a look at what's inside. The first thing we're going to see, I'm going to go ahead and adjust my camera here. I'm in my little um, video sort of box, so to speak. All right, so let's have a look at this package here. First of all, we will find four regular size hard drive screws and two small ones with what looks like a, like a smaller threading on them. So we got six screws in there. The next thing we have is a SATA cable with locking connectors. All right, that looks like a six inch cable, by the way. And then we have the hard drive boost. Wow, that was a very simple package. Okay, so inside the hard drive boost, we will find a place to mount an SSD drive. Yeah, we'll find a place to mount an SSD drive. So you've got our two and a half inch mounting holes here, 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 and we have two. That's it. Two holes. Okay, I guess that's what those two small ones are for. And then this is actually a three and a half inch adapter. So you'll use those full size screws in order to mount this inside your computer. So you can see that the interface on the back, this is where it gets a little bit more complicated. You've got your SATA power in, then you have SATA data, then you have another SATA data connector. So this one goes to your motherboard and then you, you will use your existing hard drive cable for that. And then you can use this additional cable to go out from this guy into your hard drive. So the chipset on here, and you can see that this is like a proprietary looking chipset. It just says uh, Silverstone on that chip itself. So we have no way of knowing what's in there is what does the logic that allows your HDD boost to know whether it should write any particular piece of data to the SSD or the hard drive and where to read it from. So basically the HDD boost is a way of treating an SSD kind of like a giant cache. It's kind of like RAM is, except sort of one tier down. So you got your CPU, then your CPU cache, then your RAM, then your SSD, and then your hard drive. So it's one step faster to get the data off here than it is to get it off of the hard drive that's connected to it. So thanks for watching my unboxing of the HDD Boost, and uh, thank you for everyone who participated in the Easter extravaganza.